Slim Thug explains why he refrains from visiting women's houses. Thug news. What's going on? That ain't no regular chopper. I can't think of the last time. Look. Got it. What'd he say? Gonna say me something, All right, you want me to say you something? Bet. Yeah. I never go to a woman's house, ever in life. Like, I can't remember the time I went to a woman's house. Like, that's how I, I, how much I never go to a woman's house. It, is, it just ain't going down. Like, yeah, it don't never be that important to me. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It be chicks like, y'all y'all gonna think I'm psychotic. Watch this. You wanna know how crazy I am? I talked to this chick for like four to five years. Four to five years, right? I only been to her house one time. Just one single time have I been to her house. Only one time in life. Only once. Talked to her four to five years and only been to her house one single time, bro. One single time. Now, I'm not a catfish. You just got to come to my house. You ain't going. We got to. You got to talk to concierge. You know what I'm saying? We ain't finna have no crazy exes running up on me. You know what I'm saying? Ready to die, kill you, me, and itself about the bitch. We ain't doing all that, kid. One single time. I don't go to women's houses. I just don't do that. That ain't what I do. It's like rapper. It's like when you a rapper, it's um, it's like protocol. Like That's kind of road rules. Like I, when, I'm, when I'm on the road doing a show, I can't leave and go to nobody's house. Like, what the f***? You can't do that shit. The fuck is wrong with you? You're like, you dumb? <laughs> that's how you trying to get You're like, what the fuck? Like, that's a straight setup. So, that just transferred to, you know, my that's regular the life. Shit a female to say right here. Oh, man, what the fuck? Oh, man, he must have a n or something. Uh-uh, that hit, hit not. <laughs> he ain't got no right to come over here. What's the fuck? Right. He ain't got, that's what exactly. He ain't got no right to come. You know, I don't. I have no. I have. I have the <laughs> ultimate trust issues. Bro. I will never. The another thing of my know. toxic nature that's you know, like I say, the um, the survivor know. mentality in me will never let me trust a woman come saying on. that she don't f with nobody. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't know what it's at. My survivor mentality tells me don't even believe that. Mm -mm. That you can't even put that in a woman's hands. You have to make That's your, what I mean by that. You so can't that's put that. This is in your hands. You can't even put that decision in a woman's hands. She will let you down. She will have her ex boyfriend. She will do that to make him jealous. Have yes. you as the guinea pig of yes. making jealous? I didn't think he'd come to the door, though. I just want no, him to sir. see your car. No, sir. We're not yeah, I, yeah, I just, exactly. Man, but they don't no. like that type of shit though. Mm -hmm. They won't. Yeah, tell her to come to the door then. What? Never. You said you said willing to kill me, you, and him about the bitch. No, yeah, we nah. don't trust in that. That's scary. Yeah, I ain't I ain't going over there. I'm in an apartment building. You can know where I live. Everybody know where I live. <laughs> you know, it don't matter. You can't get to you can't get, the people in my building can't get to my flow. It's a private <laughs> flow. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, so you got to talk to them downstairs, and yeah, you got to do all that before you can get up there and talk to me. And that's cool if you come there. You know, you can't come to, yeah, I, I can't come to you. I can't do that. I'm sorry. But it's just trying to be, you know, that's just survivor protocol. Like, when you move like a, see, I'm from the streets, so I still move like I'm from the streets. Like, you know, you got to do smart shit. You can't be doing dumb shit. Exactly. They say what happened to Mo3 was a prime example, you know. Exactly. You see what I'm saying? He ain't like, got to come inside. He can wait till you leave. Exactly. He's mad. Exactly. Exactly. No, no. Never will I ever make sense. let that happen. Like, I don't There's play no those games. Good. You know what I'm saying? I don't do that. Like It ain't that important. I, go to sleep. I will <laughs> up and go to sleep before I go over a woman's house. It's tough to get me over that sleep these days. I'm going to keep it real with y'all ladies. Like, it's... It's tough. Y'all be thinking I got so many hoes. I got so many rules and so much shit I put over hoes. I'm so much of a hustler. My I don't even stop doing everything till like midnight. Like I just be hustling. I look at me right now. What I did all day. I've been it's morning time. I've been up since six this morning. Hit the gym. Stepped out. No, I ain't stepped this morning. I missed that. We done hit weights. Finna go get a haircut. 
I'm gonna be running. I'm gonna probably go do some studio shit. I owe Leah verse and shit. I, you know, I ain't gotta finish that shit. So I'm gonna probably do some rapper shit right now. Off with some cars, a little bit of both. I was in the shop yesterday with my caddy. I think I gotta bring it back today. That type of shit. I'm gonna I'm uh, be doing car shit right then. I say about seven o'clock. Who am I at seven o'clock? I'm probably a regular person and, and doing some going out to eat shit. Now, I'll probably be in the studio if y'all watch me. Y'all know, I'm, whenever I come up with my next thing I want to do, I'll probably be working again. Nighttime, you see me, well, at the club till motherfucking 2 o'clock in the morning. The shit just 24 hours. So I'll be like, when, do, when am I fucking hoes? I'm never stopping. And then you holler at, you try to hit a bitch at 12 o'clock in the morning, like, hey, what's up, boo? She gonna be like, no, don't hit my line like I'm no booty call ass bitch at 12 <laughs> And most women got jobs and shit. You can't even hit their line like, what's up? Like, like you can't even play that. So you end up at home appreciating good sleep. I got a That's soft when ass man. girls say, shit, the hoes be at the studio. Man, rappers don't be wanting hoes in the sessions. It be and drink and Yeah, be you know shy. They don't want to be rapping. They don't want to be trying shit in front of hoes. They be shy. Not like, a place for a girl. Man, get these bitches out of here, man. You know. And give the studio footage, and that's he says. Get that, get that. Try to get out that bitch. Get that. Try to stay in there, like man. man. Yeah, he trying to hurry up rap. I'm yeah. Shy in front of these hoes. What he gonna say like, play all this song. Can't rap. Oh, he gonna do it. If he got some hoes, <laughs> if he got some hoes, he not recording. He just gonna sit there and play all this song. Who did I give did the money roses one? to? That's the drum. drum I got y'all watch. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been you. That's what I must say. There you go. Could have been you, man. Could have been you. Could have been you, ladies. <laughs> could have been you. Damn, it could have been you. Boss and hoes. Could have been you. Just understand that. That's what I want you to go to sleep at night with. Hey, man, I could have had that flowers. But I be playing games. And then y'all wait till it's too late. It's really to uh, punish women who thirst trap all year and don't have no Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been you. Could have, would have, should have been you. Facts. That's how they go to Oak Cliff. What it do? Thanks for tuning in to Nine Mag TV.